guys welcome back to my channel if you're new here go ahead and hit the subscribe button so you don't ever miss an upload from me and if you're an OG buddy goodie thank you so much for coming back so in today's video I'm going to be sharing with you what I eat in a day as most of you know I just recently had my baby boy about six weeks ago so I'm in the process of trying to snap back and all of that so um, the meals I'm gonna be sharing with you I'm not gonna say that they're healthy but they definitely work for me um, I'm having to keep my calorie intake up up because I am breastfeeding so um, the meals that I'm gonna share they have been helping me keep my calorie intake up but I'm not eating you know completely horrible so I just wanted to share with you guys and also this video is being sponsored by Blue Apron so I am gonna be cooking one of their meals in the video I've been using them for quite some time and I really enjoy it because it kind of helps me get outside of the box whenever I'm cooking a lot of the times whenever I cook I just do the same thing over and over especially when I'm trying to eat healthy I'll do brown rice grilled chicken and green beans like every single night so yeah using blue apron it just kind of helps me spruce things up and the meals are normally between five and eight hundred calories so it is a healthy alternative um, I'll have a link below if you guys are interested in checking them out also the first 50 people to sign up will get three meals for free so yeah be sure to check out the link below I'll have all of the information down there but um yeah without further ado we are gonna go ahead and jump into it so the first meal we're starting off with is breakfast and I like to make it really easy. I'm starting off by putting a little olive oil in the pan and I'm cooking these turkey patty sausages. I'm also going to scramble an egg or two so I like to put a little bit of butter in the pan so that it doesn't stick or anything. So I'm going to go ahead and put my eggs in there and I like to cook my eggs on low heat just so that um, it doesn't cook too fast. And Colton and I we usually double team breakfast so there's him. Um, um, cooking the sausage I like to add a little bit of salt and black pepper to my egg so I'm adding the pepper now and I added some salt too and now I'm just gonna scramble everything up and that's pretty much it the sausage is already done it doesn't take long for it to cook but um yeah this is something that I'll have sometimes in the morning and I do like to add avocado because I just love avocado So after breakfast, I normally do a quick workout. Um, so I do jumping jacks, sit-ups, squats, um, push-ups, different things like that. And after my workout, I'll have my first snack of the day. So I normally do a protein shake and I've been using this um, Body by Vi or Body by B. I'm not really sure how you pronounce it, but I put a banana in there. I put the banana in first and only do half a banana. And then after that, I put in the actual shake mix and then I also put in unsweetened almond milk and it's really, really good. It doesn't have a bad taste. It actually kind of tastes like a birthday, like a birthday cake or something. So another snack that I'll have sometimes throughout the day are these granola bars by Nature Valley or I'll just have some mixed fruit chunks that I'll pick up from the grocery store. So for lunch, I'm gonna be having a salad with chicken and avocado. So I already had my chicken made from the night before. I warmed it up in the microwave and I'm just cutting it up because I'm gonna put it on top of the salad just to make it a little bit more filling. So here's all of the items that I like to use for my salad. I have cranberries and almonds and walnuts. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and put my salad into the bowl. And um, I like to put quite a bit, but not too much. I also like to use the 50-50 mix just to add a little bit more of color and greenery like the spinach. And here I'm just putting the chicken on top of the salad. I'm gonna go ahead and add the other things as well, like the cranberries, the walnuts, and the almonds. And here I'm just cutting the avocado so I can add it to the salad as well. And you guys, I love, love, love avocado. I could eat it every single day with every single meal. And for the dressing, I'm using the Olive Garden Italian. And this has to be the best dressing ever. If you haven't tried it, then girl, you have to because it's so good. But this is a typical lunch for me. Not too heavy, but it's definitely filling. 
So for dinner, we're making a meal by Blue Apron, and this video is being sponsored by them. So we made the roasted pork with a mustard pan sauce, and it was really, really yummy. So I have all of my ingredients laid out here. And if you guys aren't familiar with Blue Apron, they uh, pretty much allow you to create these delicious kind of chef design recipes at home. And they'll deliver um, the ingredients and everything in a refrigerated box, so um, everything will be fresh even if you're not at home whenever you're package arrives so I just really love using Blue Apron because it allows me to kind of think outside the box. So we start off by cutting up everything that needs to be cut so we cut the onions and then we're also going to cut the asparagus And here I'm just adding a little bit of olive oil to the pan so we can begin cooking our pork roast. And Colton's gonna season it a little bit, so he's using some salt and black pepper and then also, I think, a pork rub. So um, now he's just gonna go ahead and add it to the pan. And then I'm also adding olive oil to the other pan so we can go ahead and start to saute the um, potatoes and the asparagus and the onion. And I added the potatoes first just so I could get them a little tender before adding the other vegetables. But now that I have those cooked a little bit, I'm going to go ahead and add the asparagus and then also the onions. And the final step to finish off the meal was to make the mustard pan sauce. We added a little bit of lemon to it just to give it some more tanginess and this is the finished meal. So we have the pork roast with um, all of our vegetables and it was really delicious. All right, you guys, so that is what I eat in the day. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, then be sure to give it a big thumbs up. And also, don't forget to check out Blue Apron. I will have a link listed below. And don't forget, the first 50 people to sign up do get their first three meals for free. Again, thank you so much for watching this video, and I will talk to you all next time. Bye. And I remember she said that the baby was coming out sideways, so his ear was kind of up to the ceiling and his head was facing, you know, the window. And she said that she had to get the forceps to try to, to try to twist his head 